Hey, thanks for tuning into Modern Dog Training. We're gonna take a look at a video with a dog named Cooper who is five months old. He's an Aussie lab doodle. Unfortunately, he got attacked by a dog when he was a young puppy and his back leg was broken. This made his socialization very difficult and somewhat stunted. Cooper's prone to barking at people, dogs, and traffic. In this video, you're going to see me using counter conditioning, the yes and treat routine, and the leave it cue for disengagement. I had a great time training. I hope you have a great time watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and comment and pass this information on to somebody who might need it. Enjoy. You ready? Okay. Oh, no. Yes! 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 Uh, that was a fun way to start off the walk, huh, buddy? Yes! So you, the significant thing about that was the nanosecond that he oriented... Oh. It's okay, good boy. The nanosecond he oriented to those kids, I marked and paid, right? And I marked and paid him like every two seconds while that event was unfolding. <laughs> Leave it. I'm going to come right over here. Jim, follow me. Stand behind me. Yes! Follow me out. Yes! 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 Not too bad couple of barks but we kept kept them under you're okay come on got a bus coming yes see He's not barking at that bus today, but based on that reaction, in two months he might be. So market pay him for the big stuff, right? Okay. Kids running, buses, trucks. Yeah, there's right? a lot going on here. Pay him for that stuff. Because, you know, he likes to bark. But, you know, he's gathering scent, he's taking food, so. He's still in the game. Yes. Right, so he's checking out this dude right here. Yes. Right, just popped right off the marker. Good boy. Right, what's that guy got? He's got a, he's got a shirt in his hand, right? So again, he may not be barking at people today, but he could be in like two or three months or a week. He does bark at people. Right. But I'm saying like he could become really incessant about it. Yeah. So make sure you mark and pay him for it. Okay. Got another dude here. <coughs> leave it. Yes. So I'm going to I'm going to go with leave it. So right there I'm going to go for my leave it cue and disengage him, right? Well, that's why I charge people money. <laughs> you hire a plumber and he doesn't fix the pipes. Now I'm you know, look, what I'm going to tell you is this. The difference between me and 99% of the people on the planet, even other trainers, is I'm quick. And I do this. Like, I do this all the time for every dog I work with. Oh, what's going on? You getting wet with me, huh? Oh, look at this. This is going to be great. Jim, let, let's get this. Stand behind me and get this with all these bikes. Yes! Right, so we're going to pay for that uh, car horn. Yes! 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 Leave 
Yes, good job. Leave it. Yes. Yes, good job. Right, so I needed some distance from her, yeah. right? Again, backpack, carrying something, wearing a hat. Leave it. Yes. Right? So he did, did great with all those kids and the bikes. It's okay. Good boy. You want to bark a little? It's okay. Good boy. What's going on? He says one, leave it, and this dog Yes. Listens. Because he's feeding them. Yeah. It's not because I'm feeding them. It's because I'm asking him to do it, and then I'm feeding him. Plenty of people have food. You just told me you carry treats, and you can't get his attention. Right? It's because I'm doing it at the right time. Leave it. Yes. Right? See the difference, oh, be yeah. see the difference between yeah, you cue, whistle, pay, versus dog name, dog name. Leave it. Leave it. Yes, good job. Leave it. Yes, good job. Leave it. Yes. Yeah, but look, I'm paying him really small pieces, yeah, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? I mean, I kind of like, I kind of gave him a lot when the bikes were there, but I had a lot to deal with. Right. Leave it. Yes. And again, here's the thing that I tell people is like, if your dog barks because they're startled, if your dog barks because they're happy, if your dog, if that's what dogs do. Right. Right? So yeah, again, they don't like. don't have to be quiet all the time. Right. And, you know, at the end of the day, it's like, I don't care why he's barking. You don't have a dog who's unsound. It's not like you brought me a dog who bit five people and he's barking because he's afraid. He's just barking because he's a dog. Yeah. Right? And he's, and he's also barking a lot more right now because take, I'm taking like 30 seconds to explain this to you. If you weren't here and I was doing this, he wouldn't be barking because I wouldn't have any other thing to focus on other right. than him. I would just be marking and paying him for that guy across the street. Yes. Right? I would just be yesing and treating him or asking him to leave it. So, you know, part of the reason why he's barking is, you know, I got to take a few seconds off to talk to my clients, right? So we're going to get these two people here and then we're going to head back in because I think we've got enough data and we don't need to be out here getting soaked. Okay. Yes. So he just saw them down there. I didn't wait. That's the I other see. thing, doing it quickly. Right. I see. Right. Getting the very, getting yeah. the very first orientation, right? And the other thing is when the other young lady came by, you saw me do this, leave it, right, to gain some more distance. I didn't just stand still, right? I gained more distance and he stopped barking. Yes. 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 Leave it. Good job. Leave it. Yes. Good job. The boy. All right, let's go in, kiddo. He's, if you gave me the, wait, let's get this big truck. This is the big one. Yes. Air brakes. Yes. If you gave me this dog for two days, and I walked him like eight times in two days, I'd be like, yeah, he's fine with me. Yeah, he's fine. He's not, this isn't a hard study at all. This is so normal. And the fact that he went through that event with the dog and he's not unsound and he's not petrified of everything is great. Yes. Like he's got a lot of good bounce back. All right, you ready? You wanna go back in and get some water? Nah, he's great. We're good. He's prancing. He's actually prancing. Good boy. Leave it. Yes. So again, cars coming, right? Like Jim said, I'm not having a conversation. I ask him to leave it and I move. He comes over here, I pay him, right? Because okay. I, don't, I don't want him to have any hesitancy. I need to move, there's a car coming. So if I want expediency, I gotta train expediently, right? I gotta train quick if I want quick behaviors.